since it isn't fully historical based, you know, the Americans could win that battle. So oh shit, the, the Revolutionary War, this type of shit, that's crazy shit. No, that isn't Revolutionary War, that's Vietnam War. Oh shit, never mind, but that's an actual, like, hold up, is that airsoft, or is that, like, uh, some no, no some that's an actual thing where you use live rounds without the actual... Oh shit, so uh, that, that, that ain't even airsoft. No, no. I, what I'm talking about right now is where you have the actual bullet casing filled with powder, and then, like, a little paper tip. That way you can use it if, and it will like cycle, but it won't actually harm the person you're aiming it at. And it'll actually make the loud noise and everything. Ah. So cool. And then it's just like... Hold yeah. up, wait. You, you're talking about blanks or bang, live routes? Bang, 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 or actual yeah. live routes? What? You're talking about blank I, shots or well, actual live routes? fully live rounds. It's more of the rounds that they can... That well, I was about to say blanks. Blank, blank shots movies. do that. Yeah, blank. Yeah, it's blanks. And you, you want to know what's funny? Is that a majority of reenactors at times are usually actual veterans themselves. Oh, shit. So they've already and been through the shit. I've done, I've done research on it. I just wish I could afford it all. I mean, once I join the military, I'll be getting over $2,000 a month. So, over time, I'll be able to afford it all. By my own M16A1 and everything. Holy shit. Your own M16. Like, your actual M16. My own M16A1, yes. Dude, you're, you're gonna go and all it, out with that shit. That's crazy heck shit. Heck yeah! <laughs> I didn't think you were... I? I didn't think you were that serious. You're talking to a war fanatic here, where World War II and the Vietnam War are my favorite wars. Oh shit. That's crazy oh, ass yeah. shit. Bro, don't, don't make me give, don't, and bro, I'm even gonna get like the M1911 sidearm. 45 ACP. <laughs> you know the caliber and everything, I was about to just say that. ACP for an M1911 standard issue sidearm, and then if I'm not mistaken, the uh, M16 uh, 556 five, 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 seven, X74, something like that. 556. Five, yeah, 556. Five, 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 Yo, hold up. My uh, dude on this uh, server saying, Is your friend joining? Eventually. <laughs> wow, you're making him wait? Oh shit. Yeah, I'm good. Oh, who? Google? No, not Google. This is some other cat. Hold on. Is it like Dr. Google Stash? Nope. Okay. Oh, bro, I was super, super close because the M16 shoots a 5.56 X45. Uh, I was like super close. Just a little off. And then you can also fit like a 20 millimeter grenade launcher on, on the bottom of it. A 20 millimeter grenade launcher. Yeah. Bro, I could like legit the uh the M16 shoots a 556 uh by 45. And then uh you can like fit a 20 millimeter grenade launcher on, on the uh, bottom uh area of the hand rail. But the M16A1 has like a, a, a 21, a 20 round magazine, you know, because it isn't a banana clip, it's a one of straight mags. And then the, uh, a, uh, the mini fit, the AR-15, well the first official AR-15 was made and served in v uh, Vietnam, if I'm not mistaken, so. Just so you know, the M4A1 is actually based off the M16. Oh shit, that's crazy shit.
But I'm, I'm pretty sure because they were all ends. So they gotta have some well, type of similarity. The, the M16A1 has a, a fixed stock, you know? And uh, if I'm not mistaken, also a long, uh, little long barrel and a uh, longer hand, uh, UGL rail. But the uh, M4A1 has a collapsible stock for mobility. It's a, a smaller uh, UGL rail. In a, uh, and I mean, nowadays they both have a 30 round and end clip, so. It's just that the M4A1 is more compact and maneuverable for uh, CQB. Well, CQC. You mean close quarters combat? combat? Yeah, CQC, close quarters combat. That's what I said. Excellent said CQC. Well, that, that, that's the short term. Yeah, I know. You're forgetting three of my uncles were in the army. And then what? And uh, one of those that was in the army uh, was originally in the navy, but uh, was shipped over to the army. <laughs> Holy shit. Mm -hmm. Army was long people, so they turned to the navy, and voila, he was shipped off. Shipped off to eight week, eight more weeks of basic training. <laughs> oh shit! Holy shit! That's crazy. Yeah, I kind of feel sorry for him, actually. You kind of feel <laughs> sorry for him. Yeah, uh. originally joining the navy just to get shipped off to the uh, army. It is what it is. Yeah, it is what it is. I do agree on that. You're awesome. Mm. Yeah, what? And this all all this happened in the space of like one. Well, hold up, wait a minute. You're still not joining in the server, or not 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 on not that yet. server, on Nomad. Oh well, uh, let's just put it this way. While I'm joining into the server, I can still talk to you. I can voice call. I, I voice chat. I just can't actual type. Even though I may not hear you over the music. This shit still ain't loading in the most, or they ain't loading into any of the servers? Bro, I haven't even tried to load into the server yet. I was about to say. Like, you you took all that time to talk to me, but you were not doing nothing. Yeah, because I was waiting for Gary's mod to load, bro. It takes like 30 minutes for it all. Oh, I was about to nothing. say, you should have told me that. Hold up, yeah, I'm a BRB.